High winds during hurricanes have the potential to rip a roof right off of a house, destroying the inside and exposing people to extreme danger. So it is critical to check and make sure that construction of your roof meets the Bahamas Building Code. There are two types of roofs common in the Bahamas, gable roofs and hip roofs. Gable roofs have sloped sides that oppose each other, with a vertical wall at its ends. In contrast, all sides are sloped on hip roofs. Hip roofs are slightly more complex, but studies and evidence after hurricane strikes show that hip roofs withstand the winds of hurricanes better than gable roofs. Roofs are typically built by erecting a series of trusses. Each truss is built with bottom cords, also called ceiling joists, top cords, also called rafters, and webs. The webs connect the top cords to the bottom cords. The overall shape of a truss is typically a triangle, with the webs positioned to create internal triangles within the truss. Triangles are naturally stable geometric structural shapes. 16 penny common nails are used to connect each web to the top and bottom cord. Each connection should have four 16 penny nails. Each end of the truss is supported by a wall of the home. The roof must be held to the walls with hurricane clips. And these hurricane clips must be hot dipped galvanized or stainless steel. The nails must be the same material as the clips or they will reduce the effectiveness of the clips. Make sure that two hurricane clips are installed on each rafter or truss, one connecting to the inside of the supporting walls, the other on the opposite side of the rafter or truss, but to the outside of the supporting wall. Every hole in the hurricane clip should have a proper nail hammered in. After all the trusses have been put into position, plywood sheathing is nailed to the top cords or the trusses. Make sure the plywood sheathing is pressure treated and is at least 5 eighths of an inch thick. For proper strength, the sheathing is to be nailed into the rafters with 8 penny ring shank nails and not smooth shank nails. Space the nails in the plywood at 4 inches around the roof perimeter and 6 inches everywhere else. For more information and roof diagrams, download the free Build Back Better manual by scanning this QR code. Ask your building control officer or a licensed engineer if you need more help. Remember to have the roof inspected by the Ministry of Works and inspections are free in Abaco and Grand Bahama following Hurricane Dorian.